<laughs> what up guys, um, welcome to the first Tommy highlights, I suppose. Oi! Hey! Hey! Shut up! Shut! Shut! Come film. So yeah, this is the first time we highlights. Tell me how long. There's um, pretty much most of exact here. Just here to tell you about the main features, highlights of the term. Come three. On to school captains. One of the key things this term was that the New South Wales Minister for Education, Adrian Piccoli, visited CTHS to showcase his announcement of the department's stronger HSE standards, changes to the higher school certificate. Some of these main changes to the HSC include establishing minimum standards for literacy and numeracy for the award of the HSC. New syllabuses will be introduced for English, Math, Science and History, including Extension Science. The number of school-based assessment tasks students have to complete will be reduced and capped to reduce student stress levels. In relation to the school directly and school life around CTHS, one of the most important things that just occurred was that the year 12s completed their AP4s over week 3 to week 5. So congratulations to them on completing this and we all wish them good luck with their HSC exams. Additionally, the school SRC induction on 29th of July... Oh, come on. Come on, Sanji, elaborate and speak with your personal experience. Okay, on the 29th of July, we had the school SRC induction assembly. This is where we, the new leaders of the school were inducted, signing the role, and were appointed in their new positions. So the Year 11s completed their AP2s and yearlies, so good on them for completing those. Yeah. Solid. Nice, Chica. Oh! <laughs> okay, so first of all, guys, um, the CHS Cross Country and Zone Athletics Carnival, Sydney North Athletics Carnival, and Regional Athletics Carnival um, has happened this term. And we have some many students participated, and many students have done excellently in these events and broken many records. Kokoda trip with the returns from last holiday. CTHS is the first department of education school to um, gain approval to walk um, the track and it was great and yeah, look at the photos and we'll see what it means. So there are a variety of academic tests that took place, um, the National Chemistry mm. Quiz, Australian Math Challenge and the Titration Competition. From the Cherrybrook Olympics, the 2016 Mafty Day raised $2,700 and of these funds to help um, the carers who assisted our group uh, on the recent Kokoda trip. Mr. Wu, congratulations. We are very proud of your prestigious award, the Choose Maths Award 2016, for motivating and inspiring students in math mathematics and enhancing their learning environments with creative practices. He was one of the 10 recipients across Australia. Congratulations. Oh! So stage 4 um, affairs, year 7 study skills session that ran on the 11th of August. Do you remember year 7 study skills? Uh, no. No? Not really. I'm sure it was fun. I'm sure it was fun. Year 7 that play on myself to receive. I hope everyone did well. Oh my god! <laughs> Yeah, I hope everyone went well. The stage for public speaking finals. 11, year 7 and 8 students spoke in the finals of the CGHS stage 4. The year 8 Gala Day happened on the last day of term, which was very fun filled day. And everyone enjoyed many different sports, and I'm sure everyone had a great day. Yeah, sports! <laughs> wait, get, wait, no. Hi, I'm Oscar. I'm Amelia, I'm with your stage 5 reps. You gotta be a little bit shorter. You gotta like fuck up. Yeah, there you go. Right. Damn it, Oscar. No. No, take my life. Yeah. Uh, Oscar, Oscar's great. Don't worry about it. Year 10 into year 11 subject selections were put through and submitted. We also had the stage 5 public speaking final where 8 speakers were chosen to compete. Each student did a fantastic job. Oh, uh, yeah. And we congratulate the winner. Year 9 and 10 attended a liquid nitrogen show that was run by Physics, e physics Education. Physics is fun, guys. We also had the year 9 NAPO results released. Good work to all year uh, is it 9. 9. Good work to all year nine who participated in the NAPA this year. Well, they had to participate. I mean, it was compulsory. Yeah, yeah, but you know, I'm sure you guys did great. Yeah, you guys yeah. did fine. Good job. Good year job. nine's usually. Hey, it's last year of doing NAPA, so it's good. What yeah. the hell is that? It looks like a hole in all. It's like. 
environmental news. The year 11 studying geography visited Rouse Hill Water Recycling Plant to continue their in-depth look at the biophysical interactions which impact on an environment, in particular the Hawkesbury Nepean River. The plant treats up to 25 million litres of wastewater per day and supplies each house in the suburban area of Rouse Hill with recycled water, which is used for flushing toilets, irrigating gardens and washing cars. What's happening? Interesting. So just keep, try to keep the rubbish away from the ground, school grounds. Chuck it in the bin, basically. That's it. Okay. International rubbish. Oh! Did you say that? Can I go on the left? It's my brother. Okay. A Japanese exchange school from Nagoya visited the school for three days. I'm sure they enjoyed their time here. The Kuwait and World Bank visit to gain an understanding of how the Bossy's curriculum is translated into actual lessons and teaching strategies. So basically they came around to the school and they sort of went in each classroom and they had a look at um, how our school is worked. So I'm sure they like really enjoyed their time here and got some a good inside of Cherry Brook's sort of teaching curriculum. Um, so International Day was a huge success and was filled with awesome foods from so many different countries. Yeah, it's such a the beautiful thing about our school is that it is so multicultural, and so International yeah. Day like showed that so well. Yeah, all beautiful colors and foods yeah. and aromas. It was great day. So we had our NADOC assembly. We held our school assemblies to celebrate oh. NADOC. So this year's theme was song lines. The living narrative of our nation. It was a wonderful assembly showcasing a range of multimedia clips which highlighted what NATO Week is all about, and that's a very good week. Okay, yeah, let's run! Um, so this time we made a new Snapchat account, so follow us if you aren't already, it's cths underscore exec. I think we've got about 100 followers already, so uh, we're doing alright I guess, but not as good as, can, as if we can be. I think our sports exec also made an Instagram account, um, I think that's cths underscore sport. I mean, you don't have to check it out, the photos aren't that great, but you know, if you want to. Uh... Oh! Wait, let me just... <laughs> Wait, what's this? <laughs> you don't even hold it right. <laughs> How are you supposed to hold it? It's like that. Oh! Wait. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wait, you still don't hold it right? <laughs> <laughs> that's right, that's right. Like that. <laughs> oh, you had it right before. <laughs> Gosh. Wait, is that your laptop? Dude, are those Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait. <laughs> what? We're all waiting. No, I can't do that. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Put that in. Yeah, I'm real. Six hours later. God damn it! I can't. I just need to get it. He's gonna be so sad if I go. Oh! <laughs> Oh, you're going to dab it out, right? Dab it out.